Hey guys, Pogo here with an exciting announcement. I recently demoed a game called Circle Sorter that I wrote for iOS. It involved solving math equations by uh, moving circles into boxes that had the correct answer to the equation on them. Uh, I ended up actually winning first place in the competition, and I'm going on to the next level, so I'm going to be working on that game. But I did get a few comments requesting um, that I demonstrate how to make that game or how to make a game for iOS. I also recently uh, surpassed 6,000 subscribers, so I want to say thank you to um, everyone, of course, to the 5,000 who were already with me, and then to the 1,000 um, who have subscribed somewhat recently. Thank you guys so much. And I'd like to combine these two things and tomorrow morning, that's March 8th, uh, 2015, at 10 o'clock a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. There's actually a shift in the uh, Daylight Savings Time. Uh, but at that time, uh, I'm going to demonstrate live how to make a similar game to Circle Sorter. In my version of the game, in the version of the game that I'm going to demonstrate, um, you know, you'll sort the circle by color. So you'll have a blue, green, orange, and yellow bin, and, you know, whatever color ball you have, you sort it into the correct bin. And we'll keep track of score, we can make the ball speed up, and we can, you know, maybe even add power-ups and other cool things like that. So, uh, join me tomorrow. We're going to use Xcode and Swift and sprite kit to do the work. Uh, the project in the end will be open source. I'll put it on GitHub so that you guys can you know, tinker with it, whatever. And you know, we'll start by building the base of the game that fully works, and then we can. Then I'll take requests for other features, and we can add on to the game. I expect it will last between an hour to an hour and a half. Although it could theoretically go longer than that um, if there's a demand high demand for that. So let me know in the comments if you plan on attending tomorrow morning. Um, I really hope that you do. Um, and if you have any interest in making iOS games or taking a look at uh, applying the Swift language, uh, make sure to come. Uh, I would recommend before you come watching the few Swift videos that I do have. Um, just to get a feel for the language, and you should probably also be fluent or decent in, you know, a language, uh, so that when I throw around words and, you know, do different operations and whatever, it'll make sense. So, again, let me know if you guys are coming. Thanks so much for 6,000 subscribers, and I hope to see a lot of people tomorrow for the live stream. Thanks, and see you soon.